Welcome back. My friend sent me a, a picture of his album art. And he's releasing his album on all the popular music streaming channels. So here's what the album art looks like. He, he designed this in Mid Journey. And it's for a track he calls Moment M. I got this track on my latest video called Black and White Photography. And I shot this on the Nikon and Pro Photo in Frisco, Texas. But I want to show you guys what we could do. Like he's, he's created a bunch of different designs, but he created this one. And so we're going to bring this in into Photoshop really quick. So that that's that's what it, it looks like currently. Let's see if I can move it up. So that's what it looks like and it's very it's very clean. So here it is at 100%, 300%. So even through that, it's really crisp, right? But I said, hey, send it to me. We could possibly make it a little rough, run a couple of recipes on it, and see what it looks like using the NYX collection. So I'm gonna run an analog uh, filter that I built. I kinda like that one, but Let's just say for the for the sake of the demo, we'll we'll use this one called Old Vintage Camera. I found. All right, so there it is. I'm gonna run a black and white recipe on it using Nick Six Silver Effects. All right, let's see. There is, I know people have been asking me, is there any lag in Photoshop? You know, like, what's the experience like? There's no lag. You can definitely use this without experiencing any kind of frustration. Like I said, this is like, ex, you know, having an external monitor. Only you have control of it. Like, you can bring it in close, you can make it large, but let's say that's what I wanted. That's kind of cool. Now, some of these filters you might be familiar with, they have similar filters in Instagram. Um, you know, I don't know about the other social media platforms, but you can kind of sort through them through your phone. These are a little bit, you have more control. So if you wanted to make adjustments to them, you could. That's cool. Let's say I wanted to run some additional analog, like we're filtering the hell out of this. Totally get that. It's not something that I would typically do, but I'm just doing this for the sake of a demo. Like, what can we do to make this look super rough? Besides filtering the hell out of it, right? And then there is something called noise, dirt and scratches, right? You can add dirt and scratches on here. The strength of it, you know. I don't know if I want that much. There we go. You can move the dirt. You could reverse it like yours. That's kind of interesting. There we go. I'll try that. And when I'm done, I can just <coughs> walk away from this. Hold on, I got it's attached to the battery. Walk away. Open my blind up. All right. I'm gonna throw this out here. How's that look? Does that look like it could be in the city somewhere? No. 